Thank you, Principal Skinner. And I want to welcome all parents and students to Tom Houster Out Elementary for our 69th Annual Science Fair. Now, students and teachers that wish to smoke are asked to please smoke only in the teacher's lounge. And please be aware that feral cats have once again taken over the roof of the cafeteria, so do not step outside with any items of food. Tetanus shots are available from the nurse's station should they become necessary. And please enjoy the view from our third floor, 56 feet above the ground, as it may not be there much longer. And remember always, a wasted mind is a terrible thing. Hi. My, my name is Regina Flechter, and my science project this year is... My science project... Oh, wow. Hi. My name is Bradley Sherry Adley, and I'd like to present my science project for this year. It's the solar system. Fact or fiction? Hi! 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 <laughs> my name is Tiffany, and my project will answer one of the biggest and greatest great old mysteries of the whole world. Can I start again? Is glitter edible? My name is Sam Lorman, and I'm in the seventh grade, and I want to present my entry to this year science fair. My mom's facelift. <laughs> my science project is called Which Detergent Works the Best? And that that's the title. Now I know what many of you are out there and you're thinking. You're saying, hey Brad, the of course the solar system's real, because it's in all the science books. But did you know that the science books also once believed that there were no such things as germs? Glitter, like <laughs> glitter? Or that the earth was <laughs> flat? So I think it was like a year ago when I was birthday cake for my best friend Shirley. Shout out to Shirley, my BFF! <laughs> LOL! <laughs> FDTQL DCC! I tested de uh, sorry. I tested detergent. Detergent! You tested detergent! Yes, Bradley, thank you. I tested detergents. And uh, her and stumbling and mumbling is showing an embarrassing lack of preparation. And and I rehearsed my presentation for my landscape artist, Hey Zeus. He doesn't speak in English, but he said it was Molly Bueno. Uh, <laughs> now you see, there's detergent A and um, detergent B. And what I did Would was. Would you be quiet, Regina? The non freaks are trying to win this thing? Why don't you be quiet, Bradley Sherry Adley? Oh. Your name rhymes with itself. <laughs> you know what, Sam L Lerman? What? You're Bradley Sherry Badly. <laughs> so while making this birthday cake, that's when the question came to me. How much glitter is too much glitter? Now, my hypothesis is very simple. If my mom gets this facelift, uh, <laughs> she will look like a crazy alien thing. And, but Dad won't divorce her. That so wasn't the case. Recently, I read a book by the late L. Ron Hubbard. Oh, oh the, the, the L is an initial. He wasn't Spanish. <laughs> now, this is he the wasn't. first piece of cloth, and I dirtied it with ketchup. And, and Now, then on the screen, you will see, in a PowerPoint presentation, digital photos of my mom before, oh. during, oh. during, oh. during, and after surgery. Oh. I was originally going to use tomato sauce, but my mom, she was, she was too busy, so... I found in the pantry some ketchup. Now, one of my key findings is that under my mom's face, she looks a lot like uh, a skinned rabbit. That. Uh, uh, only bloodier. Wow. Uh, <laughs> moving on. To do this project, I used three hamsters. The first hamster, I fed one teaspoon of glitter a day. The second hamster, I fed two teaspoons of glitter a day. The third hamster, I fed 12 teaspoons of glitter a day. I took the pieces of cloth. Sometimes you really had to jam it in there. <laughs> and I washed them, all of them. Well, except this one, because you see, I couldn't. You see, you need a control now, in the experience. Now, this is my mom's Taurus. And that is my mom. Ooh, what is that? In my support materials, I've included an article from Newsweek magazine about the planet Pluto and how it was recently downgraded from planet status. 
further proving my point that all science is temporary, that the FBI lies to us, and that they're most definitely Cylons among us. Here's a bar graph showing how and when each of the hamsters died. <laughs> now under the hanging flesh here, this is my mom's businator, which I guess isn't as pretty as my dad's secretary's businator. <laughs> Here are my support materials. <laughs> Three dead hamsters. <coughs> Here lies Mary, Kate, and Ashley. <laughs> my original, my original, my original hypothesis. Oh my golly! Detergent A. You spelled detergent A. wrong. <laughs> Board should definitely be grounds for just more qualification. No, <laughs> <laughs> Why we be so mad? <laughs> Fair winner, Regina Flector. Thank you. 